Thank you. It's a pleasure to see all of you here today, and it's a great turnout. Thank you for coming. This is a very happy, wonderful event every year, and it is uh, my distinct pleasure this year to have the opportunity to introduce Harrison Correa, your newly elected International Club President. I, I have to say just a few words of uh, uh, introduction to him. Uh, he's an immigrant from Cape Verde. He speaks Portuguese Creole. He is a, one of our first participants from the Educational Talent Search Program while he was at Durfee High School. <laughs> while there, he participated in the bilingual education programs and did extremely well there and is a 2010 graduate from Durfee High School and has participated really uh, well in the Division VI programs in ESL and other programs that we offer in the division. Um, Harrison is going to lead you extremely well in the International Club because of the qualities that he exemplifies and demonstrated as early on as ninth grade of determination and persistence and not only concern for his own goals, but for the goals of others and making sure he brings his fellow students along with him along the way. And he's always been like that and he's continuing to do that today. I know that uh, he will do great things for this club, great things for Bristol Community College and for the future, society in general. I have great hopes for him and I wanna thank so much the International Club Advisors for their great support of the club and of Harrison um, and that Diane Manson, Jackie Barry, and Regina Pirtle, and their great work with these activities and initiatives. So please give another round of applause for Harrison, and uh, he will introduce our college president. Thank you. Hi, guys. <laughs> Hi. Welcome, everyone. So good to see all of you here today. And for those who don't know me, again, my name is Harrison Correa. I am your new president of the International Club. Thanks for voting for me. <laughs> 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 and um, to start off, I would like to thank every single one of you for being here. You know, our schedule is busy, you know, class and everything. So thank you for being here. And. Uh, like, like I said, uh, I would like to thank every single one of you for being here and to celebrate the diversity of, of students and staff we have here at BCC. And, uh, and I hope that, that you will all enjoy, enjoy another year of MAP Day where, where, we could, uh, where we can all come together as one to enjoy this beautiful day and get to see uh, other countries in the, in the map and to show them where they are which is, I think is, it's a good thing. And, uh, and now it is my pleasure to introduce uh, President of BCC, Mr. Jack Sprager. He's been so supportive. Of <laughs> <laughs> He's been so supportive of our club and he helps us. And uh, let's clap for him. <laughs> Well, thank you, Harrison. A, a man of the people was just elected, right? That's wonderful. Good for you. Uh, and I know that uh, Dean uh, Sarah Morrow is very proud of uh, Harrison as an alumnus of uh, Talent Search. Uh, that's one of her uh, special uh, programs that she loves to uh, love so much. Uh, well, welcome everyone. Uh, it's always a great day in the life of our academic year uh, to celebrate our diversity. What better way? We're going to have a graphic uh, demonstration of our diversity on the map when we put the, uh, the stars uh, uh, for each of the countries represented. I think we used to put pins, but we can't afford to buy a map every year, so it, we'll use stars now. Uh, but every year we routinely run about 50 countries in Puerto Rico. Uh, and I'm very uh, proud of our diversity here at, uh, when I go o o around the state and uh, the, the region and, and in Washington and elsewhere and boasting about our diversity at uh, Bristol Community College, people are always amazed when I tell them about 
50 countries and uh, about the fact that we have 50 countries and uh, uh, in Puerto Rico and uh, you know a number of uh, second and uh, first generation people from the old countries uh, and uh, we're glad to have you with us. It's really wa wonderful. It's something that uh, I want to emphasize to you. It's not just uh, diversity for the sake of diversity. You know, we bring in someone from this country and someone from this country and that's the end of it. Uh, what we do is we embed your, the great strengths that you bring. Each of you has a unique experience, uh, like all our students. But each of you brings a different perspective. Uh, and that uh, by doing so, I don't think you appreciate the value that you bring to our college by bringing your perspective, by being, just being yourself and the way you look at things and the way you've been brought up and to look at things, uh, it's different than uh, uh, anyone else. And it, uh, uh, it uh, makes a tremendous uh, contribution to our classes, our classroom discussions. Uh, you can imagine if you had all the same people, you would have all the same views being expressed and that'd be the end of it. But the rich diversity of academic uh, exercises and academic enterprises that you bring uh, makes us all the stronger. Similarly, outside the classroom, I always uh, get on my soapbox and talk about holistic education at BCC, uh, and it's a valuable experience, uh, learning experience outside the classroom. And again, the unique perspectives that each of you brings to uh, those discussions or those activities, uh, college activities, uh, makes a terrific uh, a contribution and you make us stronger because you're here and we're very grateful for that. Uh, so we're very proud of you and all that you do and if you need any help uh, ever, please let me know. I know right after the terrible uh, time of 9-11, uh, 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 it was just a year or so after I got here, uh, I made a, a, a pledge about uh, anyone uh, that suffered because of being different uh, you know, we have a zero tolerance for things like that, and that still holds. It should hold before 9-11 uh, as well as after all, at all times. We don't, uh, we, you know, we're promoting civility at the college and in the community, and uh, so anyone that has an untoward experience, uh, you please let me know. We have other people at the college very uh, anxious to help you in that regard. Zero tolerance, okay? Uh, we're very proud of all that you do. Uh, and you know, we want to move in the, in the spring, uh, the International Club and uh, uh, Harrison already applauded, uh, and Sarah did as well, Sarah Morrill, uh, applauded uh, Diane and uh, Jackie and uh, uh, Regina, and I think Denise DiMaggio is still involved with it. So we're very grateful uh, to you for all that you do with our International Club. Uh, and what I was gonna say is in, uh, in the spring, uh, we have a wonderful event where we ask people to dress in the, uh, from their native land and the food from their native lands, uh, and, uh, and that's always wonderful. We have music and dancing, and uh, you know, it's terrific. But uh, our commitment at Bristol Community College goes beyond uh, what I call food and festival. Okay, that's wonderful and we need to have that and celebrate our diversity. But we need to embed our uh, diversity within the fabric of the college, our routine operations. And uh, that's where you come in. We move beyond food and festival to the very substance and stuff of what Bristol Community College is all about. So we're very thankful for you. I, uh, it's my pleasure now to uh, introduce to you uh, someone who is a stalwart champion of diversity and academic integrity at the college as she's our chief academic officer. Uh, and uh, please welcome our Vice President for Academic Affairs, Sarah L. Garrett. Sarah. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, that didn't sound so good. Good morning. good morning. This is a time of celebration. I feel good. I feel so good. Do you feel good? Oh, you should feel so happy. I love International Map Day. Do you? You should. Because it celebrates us, our diversity. The president is right. You know, um, I, it is so wonderful when we come together and um, our new president, Come over here. Let me have a hug. Let me have a hug. Let me have a hug. 
Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud of you. You know, they have a great smile. You know, a smile goes a long way, you know, when you greet people, you know, and, and it says something about your soul, you know, your eyes, your smile, the, the windows to your soul. And we, as a college community, when we come together, it's a beautiful thing, you know. I have our vice president, the vice president for students, Steve Ozog, is right back there, wave your hand. Vice President Ozog, <laughs> come out here. Our vice president for human resources and affirmative action, Tafa Awolaju. <laughs> our executive vice president right there, Dave Feeney. The Associate Vice President for Academic Affairs, Mike Vieira. <laughs> Denise and Diane, I just love you. Thank you so much for always remembering to tell me about coming. You know I wouldn't miss it. You know I wouldn't miss it. And uh, Dean Sarah Morrill, you know, I just love you. You know, and it's just great. Our faculty, the faculty, the faculty and staff that are committed to being here, it's all about you and the uniqueness of each and every one of you. Now, what I'd like you to do right now, because I'm not gonna ask you to sing. Like you just, Ramirez just wondering if I'm gonna ask her to sing. I just might, because I'm a little devilish sometimes like that. But I'd like for you to turn to your neighbor. Come on, turn around. Look at the person next to you. And if you're in a person not next to you, get on in a circle if you can. Turn to your neighbor. That's right, shake your neighbor's hand. Right, there you go. And tell your neighbor, tell your neighbor, I'm glad to be here. I'm glad to see you. We are BCC family. We are special. We are family. Now you know I'm going to make you sing, right? Because as a family, we learn together. We live together day to day. There's so many, many academic opportunities for you here because here is where your dreams come true. Everybody has a dream. How many of you have a dream? Come on, everybody, everybody. And we are here to help you have those dreams come true. You are gonna walk across that stage to graduation. President Spraga, Vice President Ozug, and I will be there to hand you those degrees. Oh, I see more smiles right now. Oh, a happy day that will be. So in the meantime, if there is anything we can do to help you, you've got to be able to ask us. And these days that we come together to celebrate each other, to learn more about each other, these are important times. These are important times. Talk to each other, talk to your neighbor. Find out about where each of you are from, Find out, because this is how we learn about the world around us, right? Okay, now we're gonna sing our annual song. Oh, I like that. Come on up here, Ramirez, come on. Come on up here. Ramirez, come on up here. Don't make me beg. Come on up here, all right. You know the tune. All right, here we go. Got a beautiful voice. You want to start us <laughs> off? Come on. I don't know the song. Okay. Oh, no, you're an honest young lady. Here we go. We are family. I've got all my family with me. Come on, Ramira, we are family. Everybody, I've got all my family with me. Come on, Ramira, we are family. I've got all my family with me. I'm not hearing you. We are family. I've got all my family with me. Everybody, we are family. I've got all my family with me. Oh, yeah, we are family. I've got all my family with me. Everybody, we 
Thank you, everyone. Have a wonderful day. On behalf of the International Club and the Hispanic Heritage Committee, I, uh, we would like to thank President Sprague for coming out today. And, uh, and we know how busy you all are and speaking with us and your support of our international community of students. Chief Academic Officer Sarah Garrett, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. And I need to thank uh, faculty, staff, uh, for coming out today and sharing this day with us and acknowledge our International Club advisors, Regina Pertle, uh, which you can see, I bet you you can see, if you look at the map at Brazil and you focus really hard, you might be able to see her on a little beach there. And can't you, can't you see her like waving with a big smile on her face, like na 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 Okay, so she's in Brazil at the moment. Denise DiMarzio, uh, Diane Manson, which without her, you know, because she's the one that locates all the countries on the map. So, you know, <laughs> that, is, that is a task. Um, and that's why I'm here and she's there. Um, and special thanks to all of you students, because without you, this celebration wouldn't be possible and we wouldn't have the richness that we have at our, in our classrooms and, and at the school. So without further delay, I am going to call um, the names of the countries in your program in that order, starting with A, so you can follow along. The students that are here to represent your country, please, when I call the country, come on up. And if there's anyone else here um, from this country that I call, please stand up, OK? So we're going to start right at the beginning. Are you ready? Excellent. Albania. Anyone else from Albania? Stand up. <laughs> Algeria. Yep, I don't think we have a student able to come from Algeria. Are you Algerian? <laughs> okay. We do have Australia. We have Armenia first. And I think Diane's going to put the sticker. And Australia. I know we have a student from Australia. He's coming? Okay. I think we have a couple of students from Australia this semester. We do have one more. Bahamas. And Bangladesh, Tamina. Bolivia. Brazil. She's wearing the green soccer colors. I was teasing her, because in Brazil, they're also known for the bikinis. <laughs> Bulgaria. Burma. Cambodia. 
There he is. Canada and Cape Verde. I won't make you sing, Romera. <laughs> Chile. <laughs> Go ahead. Do, do, you remember, do you remember in November last year when the miners, 700 meters in land in the ground, coming up, they say, Chi, Chi, Le, Le, Chi, 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 Le, 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 Viva Chile. That's my point. Viva Chile. Excellent. Thank you, Harry. China. China. Do we have any other students from China? Please stand if you're from China. Just one today. Colombia. Colombia. Anybody else from Colombia? No, just today, Monica. Thank you. Cuba. Uh, I don't know if he made it. Okay. Dominican Republic. Ecuador. And Egypt. There she is. El Salvador. Estonia. And we have to add one, Ethiopia. There we go. <laughs> Excellent. Guatemala. Guinea Bissau. Is Guinea Bissau? I'm sorry, Guinea Bissau. Did I say it better? Okay. You should correct my pronunciation. That's right, because I correct yours in class. <laughs> Haiti. There you go. Anybody from Haiti, stand up. There you go. India. Iran. No, nope, not here. Jamaica. That's you? <laughs> Japan.
Beautiful. Thank you, Yuki. Thank you. When I see students dressed in their native dress, I sometimes want to live there, right? <laughs> Just to be able to dress like that. Thank you. Korea. Lebanon. Mali, Mexico, no. yes, we should be clapping, that's right, Morocco, Nigeria, <laughs> Pakistan. Panama. Peru? Peru, now she's ready. Woo! Beautiful, thank you. Poland. Portugal. Puerto Rico. Anybody from Puerto Rico, stand up, please. Or wave. Yeah. <laughs> In Russia. <laughs> Senegal. Senegal. Is Romeo here? Spain. Spain. Here she is. Switzerland. Taiwan. I got your last name. Thailand. Ukraine.
All right, don't all get up and jump up at once in the back. United States. <laughs> Who wants to put the sticker up for the United States? <laughs> Oh, look at this. I love it. I love the enthusiasm. So the blonde guy standing next to the blonde lady, that's Diane Sonnick. <laughs> Nice, nice, congratulations. Venezuela. That's you again. Yep. Vietnam. Okay. And that's it, right, Diane? And that concludes the countries represented here at Bristol Community College. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you so much. We have a, a couple of closing. Oh, Philippines. Philippines. Who's here, Philippines? Oh, I'm sorry. Is there any other country we have not named? Cape Verde, we did Cape Verde. You want two stars, huh? Thank you, thank you. We have some closing remarks by the International Club's Vice President, Omaira Kichado. Did I say it right? Yes, good enough, thank you. Omaira. Good afternoon, everyone. Um, I would like to Thanks everyone for attending and congratulate Harrison for his wonderful speech. <laughs> I hope everyone had a good time and enjoyed each other's company. A special thanks to um, our president, John Brega, Jackie Berry, and Diane Manson for taking time out of their um, day to spend it with us. I am Omaira Cachado, the vice president, <laughs> and enjoy our refreshment. <laughs> Thank you.